Good morning guys. So I am currently finishing breakfast. Breakfast isn't the most appetizing meal of the day. I've never been into breakfast food that much so I look more forward to lunch and dinner. Um, but eating breakfast nonetheless and honestly after I do that I might go back to sleep or finish my Barbara book. I am um, I'm really hoping that I can go down and get a pickling today. I've been asking about it since yesterday morning um because I have a peripheral IV but they they just they don't work well on me and usually when I'm gonna stay for a CF inpatient stay um I get a pick line and so it's been a whole hoopla but we'll see how that goes um slept pretty well last night I did notice that last night I did not wake up coughing um that was after only a day and a half of antibiotics and so that was really nice to like, except for when they came in to do vitals, I slept right through the night and I did not wake up coughing my brains out, um, which is already a massive improvement because the past three nights before I went to the ER, I was coughing, coughing, coughing up all night, just couldn't sleep, just coughing all night long. So that was a really nice improvement. And um, yeah, it is a uh, gray, rainy day today. So not a bad day to be inside. Actually, it's kind of funny. Uh, the day I went to the ER, I was kind of upset because it was a beautiful, sunny, um, like, 80 degree day. But, literally, since I've been in here, it's been gray and rainy, and there are, like, I know there's, like, a 100% chance of rain tomorrow, so it's, like, wouldn't have really been going down to the horses much anyway. Um, so, yeah, just, uh, finishing breakfast and watching some YouTube and, uh, hanging out. Hey guys, so ignore my, I'm kind of like messy hair, don't care. Um, I just finished my second treatment of the day. I think the antibiotic like side effects per se, not really side effects, but more just like, I don't know what to call it. Anyway, I think they're hitting me because I've just like been sleeping most of the afternoon. I conked out for about an hour. Um, it was kind of nice, the respiratory therapist said he came in here and he saw me like fast asleep and so he let me sleep for 30 more minutes before I did my treatment so that was nice of him um so I slept for most of the afternoon and now I just did my treatment and ordered some lunch and um so far no no more news about the pick line I think at this point I'm probably not going to get it today because it's almost like two o'clock now um but I did talk to the doctor also and they said that they're going to set me up a dental consult to hopefully get this taken care of so that's nice um and yeah i'm just spending the day resting it's just a gloomy day outside i'm about to call my brother um because he tried to call me while i was sleeping obviously so i'm going to call him back and uh just keep on keeping on so i hope you guys are having a good day as well as you can and uh, i'll see you guys in a little while Guys, so just finished lunch and just hanging out. Maybe tomorrow I'll give you a tour of the room. It's it's pretty simple. Maybe I'll just show you now. Couch, bathroom, me, best machine, door, and then over there just a bunch of random stuff. Um, so I just want to talk a little bit about um, I don't know feeling more positive, I guess, uh, within the past, the rest of the day, because when I had to come in on Monday, I was really in a, in a really dark and just not good place. I spent about 20 minutes at the horses, hugging them, crying. I spent, I kind of was okay going through the ER, just getting all that stuff done, but then once I was in this bed, and alone again after all that, I spent about another 30 minutes crying. And then uh, Tuesday wasn't, or yesterday wasn't much, much better than that. Um, it was a little bit better, like I said on my vlog. But it, again, once nighttime hit, I was just, and just looking at this board and thinking about Saturday and just wasn't, wasn't feeling uh, like myself. But the latter half of this day has been a lot better. I think one, the antibiotics are starting to kick in. I haven't had a fever. So I'm just feeling better physically. I think it's helping me feel better emotionally. Um, but also just kind of 
it's like my brain does this switch of, oh yeah, I wanted to ride and going to the horses and training them and all this to hospital mode, if you will. And it's like, okay, this is what I need to do to get out of here so I can go back to riding and training the horses. So it's like, I've had this switch where it's, it's not that I'm not gonna ride. It's not that I'm not gonna see the horses. It's not that it's over. It's literally just a little bump, a little short space of time in between now and then. It's just, I mean, like, like I was thinking on Monday night, I was like, I've waited six months to ride and now I can't and I was almost there. But now it's more of, I waited six months to ride. What's two more weeks, you know? And so, I'm very thankful for that shift in perspective because it makes things a lot easier. And that's not to say that I'm not going to sit here and bawl my eyes out at some point because I probably will. Saturday will probably be a pretty hard day. But um, it it's it's a lot better than it was uh, the past two days. So I'm really thankful for that. And, um, yeah, that's about all I got. Hey, guys. I'm going to go ahead and say good night. Um, I just finished my third treatment and I, the nurse came in and did a flu swab, which is always the most pleasant thing in the world. Um, they don't hurt. I wouldn't say they hurt, but, uh, having something stuck up your nose doesn't exactly feel good either. It just makes me want to sneeze. Um, so they did that. I don't think that's going to come back positive. I mean, I got my flu shot, so I'm not really worried about that. Um, and, <coughs> and <coughs> order <coughs> get her soon and just uh kind of chill out because there's nothing really else to do for tonight so with that thank you guys so much for coming along on my day today and i will see you guys tomorrow good night